Hi there, welcome to the Top Dog Tips YouTube channel. Thanks for joining us today. We're gonna to be talking about hydrocortisone cream for dogs, what it is and how to use it safely. And then at the end, I'm going to recommend four different hydrocortisone creams that you can use for your dog. Before we get into that, please be sure to like and subscribe to our channel here on YouTube. That's how we continue to grow the channel and put out great content for our viewers. Also be sure to subscribe to our website, topdogtips.com. If you subscribe using the link in the description below you'll receive a free ebook on 25 vet recommended homemade dog food recipes without further ado let's get into it hydrocortisone is a medicinal substance found in many human grade topical products its main utilization is in treating inflammation or allergic reactions particularly if they involve skin rash flare-ups recently hydrocortisone is becoming used in veterinary products and one of the more commonly items is a hydrocortisone cream for dogs before this glucocorticoids were the most commonly used type of treatment for various dog skin conditions however after recent studies discovered their lack of skin penetration and potential side effects for the dogs, making the risk to reward ratio not worth it. Veterinary dermatologists stopped using it. They did not recommend them any longer and companies have developed new and better products thanks to esterification to a hydrocortisone template molecule and studies showed them to be effective and safer for dogs. We'll link to those studies. This hydrocortisone for dogs products include creams and sprays and companies tested them for efficacy on several canine skin problems, including dermatitis, allergies, pruritus, and more. In a particular large 2012 study, which we'll link in the description, it focused on testing the safety and e efficacy of hydrocortisone for dogs and found it to be without adverse effects. The majority of dogs achieved a 50% or more reduction in skin inflammation and related skin problems. Scientists also found that hydrocortisone also improved barrier skin function in tested dogs. So what exactly is hydrocortisone cream for dogs? Hydrocortisone will often contain high concentrations of corticosteroids. Corticosteroids are a type of hormone steroid and studies showed that their topical use to be effective at treating irritated, itchy, inflamed, and dry skin in dogs. Corticosteroids came in two forms, hormones that can naturally be found in a dog's body. Those are called mineral corticoids, and then they manufactured synthetic products common in veterinary medicines, glucocorticoids, for example, just like we mentioned earlier. Hydrocortisone products made for people are not recommended for dogs. There is a difference between your hydrocortisone topical for you and then dog-friendly hydrocortisone cream. Human grade hydrocortisone is not FDA approved for animals and is not vet recommended to treat dog skin problems. While hydrocortisone creams in your medicine cabinet could in fact treat an itchy area, rash, or hot spot on your dog's skin, if the dog were to lick that cream, there's a chance that there will be adverse effects like weakened bladder, diarrhea, vomiting, and dehydration. Luckily for you and your pet, there are multiple hydrocortisone creams for dogs, as well as hydrocortisone lotions, sprays, oral medications, and even medicated shampoos shampoos containing hydrocortisone specifically designed for a canine patient. They are often used and sadly misused in veterinary dermatology. However, when following safety instructions, they are extremely effective for treating several skin issues in dogs. So let's talk about some uses for hydrocortisone creams and what they would be used for. The first one is atopic dermatitis. Atopic dermatitis is a veterinarian term used to explain a chronic skin issue linked to a dog's allergic reaction. Any of the following are likely to be recommended and prescribed by your your vet to combat this skin problem, antihistamines, cyclosporine, and corticosteroids like hydrocortisone cream. These can be oral or top prescription products. Topicals will be directly applied to the inflamed skin. Several studies found that hydrocortisone is safe and can significantly improve atopic dermatitis conditions in dogs, and we will link to those studies. Number two, other canine allergies. Dogs may experience different allergic reactions. You'll know your dog is suffering from allergies if they exhibit any kind of the following signs. Runny nose, excessive sneezing, biting and licking their paws, rash development, itchy skin, and or lethargy. While a chronic allergy in dogs is best looked at by a veterinarian, non-threatening allergies, many of which are present seasonally, can be treated by hydrocortisone cream for dogs and other hydrocortisone products such as flea allergy dermatitis. It's important to note that hydrocortisone will not treat allergies 
at their core, the effect of hydrocortisone is merely easing any potential or inflammation or itchiness found on your dog's skin. The third one is pruritus, which is also known as hot spots. A dog with pruritus is more likely to exacerbate common dog ailments such as pest bites from mites, ticks, or fleas, allergies, or non-serious injuries such as minor cuts or scratches. The reason being is when your dog has hot spots, their immune system is weakened. And so if they got bitten by mites, ticks, or fleas, or they have allergies, it will be a much worse case if the dog has hot spots than if a dog does not. Dogs are more likely to itch, lick, or bite at their own skin or paws in such cases, further complicating the issue. Studies have shown that hydrocortisone cream for dogs can help in the case of pruritus. We'll link to that study as well. Pruritus in dogs is a chronic itch that can be linked to pest bites and allergies. Pruritus can lead to or be associated with the development of hotspots, moist dermatitis, or pyotraumatic dermatitis. Hotspots are more common in some dog breeds like beagles. The fourth use it could be used on is poison oak or poison ivy or sumac. Rashes from toxic plants like poison oak or ivy typically subside within less than a month. However, the presence of itching can prolong, make this longer, and cause the skin to become inflamed and possibly lead to more serious infections in dogs. Hydrocortisone cream is an effective medicine for these issues specifically. It doesn't intend to treat, but merely eases discomfort in the pet, reducing or eliminating itching, allowing for a quicker recovery. And the fifth use is Addison's disease or hyperadrenocortisone. Corticism. Addison's disease affects the dog's endocrine system and results from the inadequate hormonal production from the adrenal glands. It's these very glands located near a dog's kidneys that produce the hormones called mineral corticoids. Addison's disease symptoms in dogs include but are not limited to low heart rate, collapsing, dehydration, lack of appetite and vomiting. Now let's talk about some vet approved hydrocortisone cream for dogs. While you can use hydrocortisone products designed for people technically, we don't have any studies to know proper safe dosage for dogs. And not only that, like we said, you know, if your dog ends up licking or ingesting it, there could be some severe adverse effects. So we don't recommend it. If you have a way to prevent them and you feel okay with it, then go ahead. But I am not recommending that you do that. The FDA approves certain dog-friendly hydrocortisone products. They are safe to use, especially when treating simple skin issue, like a tiny rash without the need for guidance from a veterinarian. Quick note, you should only do this if the inflamed skin is not paired with additional symptoms. So number one, and this can be found on Amazon, Zymox topical spray with hydrocortisone for dogs. Zymox is the best known brand among pet owners and veterinarians. They also have an ear cleaner. The company makes several products designed to ease skin inflammation, itchiness, including dog shampoos, supplemented with hydrocortisone and skin infections. And just like I said, ear infection treatments. The company used to have the largest library of studies testing their products with their sites rebranding. They have since removed it. The Zymox cortisone topical spray is also a disinfectant. So there's no need to wash, dab, or dry the area before applying. Additionally, it fights infection by protecting the immune system against bacteria and is safe if your dog licks the medicated area. The second one is Remedy in Recovery Hydrocortisone Lotion for Dogs. When applied directly to the skin after a soothing bath or gentle rinsing of the inflamed area, the Remedy in Recovery Low Dose Hydrocortisone Cream for Dogs helps reduce redness, inflammation, hydrates the skin, and eases irritation in dogs. Due to its lower doses of hydrocortisone, this may be an ideal addition to a monthly dog grooming routine. The third one is Veterinary Formula Clinical Care Itch Relief Spray for Dogs. You can find this one on Amazon as well and the one that I just listed before. You can find that on Amazon as well. We'll be linking to all these products in the description. So let's talk about it. Veterinary Formula Clinical Care. It's a dye-free anti-inflammatory spray meant to be used for minor skin ailments in dogs and most commonly used by dog owners for itch relief and hot spots. You can also use it to heal wounds on dogs, reduce swelling and redness and insect bites for hot spots dermatitis and similar skin problems is recommended to use this alongside their antiseptic shampoo and itch supplements the fourth that approved hydrocortisone is oral medication for pet skin issues that do not resolve within one to two weeks of utilizing or using hydrocortisone cream for dogs contact your pet's veterinarian for an appointment be as specific as possible during the appointment when the vet and staff ask questions it may help them deduce the underlying issue as to why the treatment's not working and what solution to pick going forward your vet will likely suggest to prescribe medications containing cortisol these medications fight infection reduce redness and swelling in dogs 
veins and help with pain management, guiding the dog through the healing process more quickly and efficiently than the hydrocortisone cream that you've used or other over-the-counter hydrocortisone ointments. Lastly, let's talk about how to safely apply hydrocortisone cream. Number one, get a recovery cone collar. Every dog owner should use an inflatable collar or an Elizabethan collar, often referred to as a head cone or recovery cone in case infection strikes. It's a handy household item to the modern pet owner just in case. So basically, if you get your dog neutered, don't throw that out because they could get skin infections later on and it would be nice to have. These types of collars and cones come in different sizes and materials, some plastic, some foam, to make sure there's a good fit and comfort for your dog. They'll keep your dog from licking and chewing on parts of their body, which causes it to be vulnerable to infection. One of the second ways to apply hydrocortisone cream is check for open wounds when the skin becomes inflamed. Itching follows naturally. Some dogs may even stress over the dry, itchy skin, pawing and biting at it incessantly, which can cause the skin to break and open wounds. This is where you avoid hydrocortisone, or at least a direct application. So if you're gonna apply hydrocortisone, do not apply it on or near an open wound. Always check the rash for any signs of open skin before applying and contact your vet should any bleeding occur. The third way is you just ask for help. It's likely the raised red area of the skin causing your dog discomfort, which is why it may be ideal or even necessary for you to request some help from a housemate or neighbor. When applying hydrocortisone cream, when working together, you can ensure your dog's calmer as you apply medicine to their skin. Avoid holding the dog forcibly down as this could cause them more distress. I can tell you that is for sure the truth. As a new pet owner, when I first tried to clip my dog's nails, I thought that, okay, I can do it. I'm a strong guy. I can clip my dog's nails on my own. I don't need help. And the tighter I held my dog, the more she would freak out. And I regret that decision as now it's been a year or so and I've had to continue to coax her to get her out of that. Holding her is not forcibly holding her, but also rewarding her. So it's taken time because I did that one time. So I don't recommend forcibly holding your dog or you could also hurt your dog as well. If you forcibly hurt them, they will do whatever they can to get out of that forcibly held down position. Make sure you wash your hands before applying on your dog's skin. The fifth one is use a cotton tip applicator. You may want to use a cotton swab, apply the cream to one end and gently spread it around the rash. This is another method intended to safeguard from the potential of infection is simply the easiest way to apply the ointment. And then the sixth one is keep the inflamed skin clean. Anytime animals experience dry, irritated skin, like I said before, they will lick, itch, and even bite it in an attempt to soothe or heal the area. Without them knowing, this attention worsens swelling and it spreads the rash and increases their chances of infection, which is why it's important to routinely wash the area, particularly before applying hydrocortisone cream for dogs or any other topical solution. So let's answer some common questions that someone may have if they wanna know more or if they are in the situation. So will hydrocortisone cream hurt your dog? Hydrocortisone cream will not hurt your dog as long as you use the version engineered or designed specifically for animals. You should not use the human version of hydrocortisone cream. Once the cream dries, you do not have to worry as much about your dog licking it the worst that is likely to happen if he licks dry hard your cortisone cream is some foaming or drooling can i use hydrocortisone on dogs hot spots yes hydrocortisone cream works well on dogs hot spots just make sure to use a product for dogs specifically and follow the instructions on the tube what human creams are safe for dogs so there's only certain human creams that are safe for dogs when in doubt it's always best to ask your veterinarian before using any human cream that said aspirin tagamet HB, Pepsid AC, Claritin, Zyrtec, Benadryl, Artificial Tears, and Neosporin are typically safe for dogs. Well, that's gonna do it for us here at Top Dog Tips. If you learned something new from the video today, please be sure to like the video, subscribe to our channel. That's how we continue to grow our channel and continue to put out great content for our viewers and listeners. With that, I hope you have a great day and we'll talk to you soon.